After finishing an amazing three month trip in Europe and the Middle East, we found ourselves back on a plane heading home to Indonesia. Now, at the time of filming this, regulations required us to go through an extensive, mandatory seven night quarantine. Luckily for you, it has now changed to only four nights. So, although ours was a few days longer, the process is unchanged and you'll have a very similar experience. We'll be sharing with you everything from the prices, the airport process, and the overall experience quarantining at the hotel. Welcome back home. Welcome back home. Okay guys, so we just landed here in Jakarta, Indonesia. Uh, we have to go through the quarantine process. So this is actually my first time doing the quarantine process here in Indonesia. So let's see what it's gonna be like. So there were a few documents that we did have to prepare before we actually flew here. Hey guys, Alex from the future here. Um, I forgot to mention in the video what you need when you land in Jakarta. So I'm gonna go over that really quick. First thing is your visa, obviously, when you land. Uh, the second thing is your PCR test that needs to be 72 hours before your departure flight to uh, Indonesia. Um, the last thing you need is your vaccine, which I have on my phone, and your QR code that you get when you book your quarantine hotel. The hotel actually provides that for you. All right, back to the video. We've actually never been in this section of the terminal before. Me too. Okay, so the first thing we're doing immediately as soon as we're getting off the plane is health examination result form on, you have to fill out on paper, and this is what it looks like. And the only thing it's asking for is your name, your passport number, um, where you're staying, and if you have a PCR test already. That's it. Okay, so we just got our health certificate uh, checked. So they checked our vaccine, they checked our PCR test, and uh, yeah, that was it. And uh, yeah, that was a mess actually. We waited probably an hour for that. Made it through literally all the steps and we're now gonna go pick up our bags. Look at all these bags, guys. This is how long everything has taken, so bags are getting filled up pretty quickly. Oh my God, get out. <laughs> All right guys, so quickly summarize, we finally got our bags. Um, the first step you're gonna do is to fill out your health decla declaration form, which is pretty simple. And then you gotta wait in a really messy line, like there's no organization to it. We're lucky we were at the front um, because we got off the plane first, but if, you're in, if you don't get off the front of the plane, you're gonna be waiting there two hours, so hopefully Jakarta fixes that by the time you get here. And then the second step is basically to get your PCR test. It's free. It's included with your hotel quarantine package purchase. Um, that took actually pretty quickly, only 15-20 minutes. And then, um, yeah, we just had our health declaration form checked, and then we went through customs to pick our bags up right after. <laughs> So as we're leaving the airport, the police officer actually checks for your hotel reservation QR code um, and actually checks your passport as well to confirm that. And the hotel actually keeps your passport for the full week that you're quarantining here in Jakarta. So yeah, you're without a passport so you can't leave the hotel. It's a, it's a safety measure. Okay. So this taxi is included with what we pay in the hotel. Yeah. So, yeah, basically we, we pay this taxi include, including... Uh, with the reservation. Yeah, with the reservation. This is the only time you're gonna see fresh air. 
a shame for the next seven days we're not going to be able to enjoy these amazing facilities. Because in the next hour we're going to be stuck in the room. Well, actually for the next seven days we're going to be stuck in the room, but... The last time we see fresh air here in Jakarta. So it looks like the check-in process um, for hotels here in Jakarta is uh, separate from the hotel lobby. So we got brought in through the basement and uh, took the elevator up to the pool level where they have set up a re uh, reception desk here for checking in guests for quarantine, uh, which is understandable. But man, do I miss Jakarta. Look at this beautiful view. Wow, I missed it here. Wow, guys, look at this incredible view. Honestly, guys, this is gonna be a great place to get some work done over the next few days. Okay guys, good morning from the JS Luanza. Today is officially our second day of quarantine, even though really it's our first. But uh, food has just arrived. Let me guys show you what lunch here is like, because I, I overslept. I've been jet lagged, so I missed breakfast. This right here, guys, is where all the food actually gets delivered. So when you order the food, it gets dropped off at that table and they ring the bell and then you go pick it up. So this is what's arrived for lunch here. I ordered the club sandwich. Everything is plastic wrapped. So sandwich, french fries, some salad and watermelon. Mm -hmm. love. So far the food is great and you get a salad, some fresh fruit pretty much with every single meal here. They provided us like a crap ton of water. Most of it I put already in the fridge. And that did not work out the way I wanted it to. Sitting in quarantine will literally drive you crazy if you don't keep busy. So I decided to work on something exciting. After months of planning, I'm finally gonna get my first merch designed. And what better way to sell it than with a brand new store? So for this video, I partnered with Zyra to help me create my brand new online store. Now, if you've never heard of Zyro, I'll be honest, neither have I before this, but that's where it changes. After checking out some of their features, I learned that they have an AI tool that will literally write text and create logos for you at the touch of a button. That's unreal. So you don't need any design or coding skills at all, which is probably why it takes only minutes to make your very first website. So if you've ever thought about starting a business, selling products, or even creating a blog online, you can use my code Alexander at checkout to get 72% off and three months for free on any yearly plans. So this right here is the premier club room that I'm staying in. Katanya and I are actually staying in separate rooms because Indonesia has uh, some laws requiring um, non-married couples and uh, non-family members to be staying in different rooms. Even though for some reason I've also seen a lot of foreigners coming into Jakarta specifically where they stay in uh, the same room. So that might be a thing you guys wanna do your research on when you're booking your hotel in, in Indonesia because some hotels are allowing you to stay if you're a foreigner in the same room and then some aren't so double check on that however in the premiere room you have this incredible desk for working this is where i'm be doing all of my video editing over the next seven days got my coffee right here they provided a sugar coffee sweetener tea creamer a lot of water as i already shown you up top you have a really large TV. It's just probably like a 32, 40 inch. Right across from the TV is the sofa, the large queen or king size bed. I think this is a king maybe. Um, as well as your nightstands. What's great about this premier room is that you have three international plugs and two USBs right next to it. This is your phone to order all of your food or any requests. Um, this right here is, uh, you got some nice robes. Um, laundry bags, which I will explain in just a minute. And then on the other side here is your safe and then bag down there. Let me guys show you the bathroom. So the premier room actually has a bathtub with this beautiful glass uh, separation with the bedroom. Lots of towels here, lots and lots of soap, oh my gosh. Uh, cotton buds, shower cap. I don't know why I need six toothbrushes, but they've given that to me. Um, and you've got this beautiful, beautiful shower um, in addition to your bathtub and then of course your bidet. Now I had mentioned to you guys that uh, me and Katanya are in separate rooms, but we do have adjoining rooms. So as you can, can see, that door right there, uh, I can open to Katanya's room. So 
even though we are quarantined together, we kind of aren't. Um, so let me go show you guys her room because her room is a little different. So the room I'm staying in is called the Premier Club Room and her room is called the Deluxe Twin Room. So let me guys show you what the Deluxe Twin Room is so you guys get an idea of the price difference and what you get for your money. So as I mentioned, these rooms are connecting. I have a door, she has a door. Hello. And this is the Deluxe Twin. So two beds, they are double beds looks like with a nice stand in between. And of course, another beautiful view overlooking Jakarta here. She has a longer table here with a smaller TV. Um, same thing, waters, coffees. She's also got a fridge as well, toilet paper underneath. She just got her vegetarian break or lunch actually. Caesar salad, nice. And yeah, same thing here. Um, same wardrobe pretty much, uh, laundry, slippers. And the difference with this one is that um, her bathroom is a little smaller. She's got a single sink, um, a toilet, and the shower. She doesn't have a bathtub. Honestly though, if you have family, if you have kids, this would be perfect. The parents would be sleeping here and the kids would be sleeping in the room next door. Good morning guys from our very last day in quarantine. I figured I'd skip to the very end and share with you all the most important things um, to know about quarantine. But before we get into that, uh, this morning started off to a painful start because we got woken up at 7.30 to do our PCR test and uh, yeah, that was painful. So now with quarantine ending, let's answer some of the most important questions you guys might have. And no bigger than the price. Let, let's talk about the price here for quarantine. Um, so we're staying at Jay's Luanza and you guys need to understand that this is like a four or five star hotel It's located right in the center of downtown in Jakarta It's got beautiful downtown views outside these gorgeous like floor-to-ceiling windows um, But they are very competitive price because this is the premier room as I mentioned This is actually one of the more expensive rooms priced at 13.6 million IDR and that's just for one person uh, if you're adding an additional person for the room um, it's going to be an extra 6.8 million some of you may be looking for what is the most affordable option I can get here in in Jakarta um, when I'm quarantining and that is going to be 8.6 million IDR um, so if you're looking for the budget option, 8.6 million is going to be your cheapest option no matter really where you go um, here in Jakarta. That's 8 million is roughly about what all the hotels are going to be charging. And you might as well go for the four to five star hotels because you're going to be spending the same amount of money. You might as well get better service uh, staying at a four or five star hotel like JS Luanza. Now let's talk about the meals. Uh, you get three meals a day here, which is a lot, I think. And the meals at JS Luanza are incredible and they have an extensive menu. You're, there's no way you're going to get through the entire menu if you're staying here by yourself. But because I have Catania with me, uh, we've gotten almost through the entire menu. Um, they offer vegetarian, vegan, kids menu, as well as uh, Western and Asian options as well. So again, they have a huge variety. And if that's not enough, they even have the a la carte menu, which is the full hotel menu, not the quarantine menu. Um, so you can pick from that as well for an extra charge. But so far, I must say, this has been an incredible stay here at JS Luanza. I mean, look at all this room. Got a beautiful TV back here. It's been honestly great. All right guys, it's our last day here in quarantine. We got our bags packed. It's time to get out of here and head back to Bali. Now that we're checking out, I'm kind of disappointed we didn't get to experience all these all these amazing facilities because they've got a really nice bar here, they've got a lounge up there. It's all really beautiful here. This is the letter for to be saw at the end. Oh really? Okay. Okay. So we need this to fly. Yeah. Okay. As we were checking out, I saw that they have like a huge stack of passports and there's a lot of Japanese actually staying here. But uh, we've just ordered our taxi here, guys. We've had an amazing stay here at the JS Luanza. If you guys have any questions about quarantine here in Indonesia, Jakarta, comment down below any questions. I'll be happy to answer them if there's anything that I missed. And uh, yeah, guys, highly recommend staying here. This place is incredible. I just wish we were able to enjoy this place. It's so beautiful down here. So thank you guys so much for watching today's video. If you enjoyed it, give it a like. 
comment below any questions you guys might have and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.